There is no reason anymore not to run Windows 10 Pro retail version on your PC. Get it now, $12.50 only, instant delivery on a brand new secured web store. Hello and welcome to part 51 of this Let's Play Skyrim Special Edition, the 2021 Ultimate Graphics Edition, based as always on the 2021 Ultimate uh, Graphics Tutorial. So the last part, part 50, our 50 anniversary part, we did some uh, pretty major quest line for the Dongar DLC. We did find this, uh, what was it? Um, this dragon priest or something who can read a Elder Scroll and it seems it was just a part of three Elder Scrolls and we need to find the other two uh, Elder Scrolls so what I um, want to do is finish this quest line from the Dongar DLC because that allows us to maybe to go back to our normal selves without being a vampire because I don't really care that much about, vamp uh, about vampire powers I'd rather have my own uh, stuff um, so yeah I have my own fighting skills. So we were here last time. Sarana wanted to talk with us. And I promise you guys that we would continue in the next part. Because uh, we were way over 40 minutes already. So let me set my timer. My 40 minutes. Right now. And let's see what Sarana has to say. That moth priest, Dexian. He said moth priest, yeah. Other that's other the guy. Homes. I think I know where we can start looking. Didn't want that moth getting wind of it. Especially my father. Okay. Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just... a means to an end. We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. Okay. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Okay. Um. <laughs> this is a pretty hard answer. No, um, sounds like she was being cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Um, all good options. I would say hiding with a down guard, sealed away. Wait, that almost makes sense. I used to help my mother tend a garden in the court. Yeah, that's why I remember all of the ingredients this for our pretty much. Came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place, too peaceful. Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is. I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. Trust me, I lived here a very long time and I know every nook and cranny. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Sure. Come on, it's just around the side. Lead the way. Also here in the light you can see how good the texture quality here looks from uh, Clever Sharp. Almost looks like parallax textures. Maybe it is parallax textures, but uh, it looks uh, l yeah, like it has a lot of depth. Yes. So that's a good what thing. Nothing, just go ahead. I will activate the compass and so let's see. Um, yeah, we can have these three quests active. So, um, oh, I probably need to lead the way, right? As usual. So let's uh, get out of here and let's go to that side of the castle where the ingredients are for potions, hopefully, if her story is true. Oh wow, that's uh, in the middle of the night here. We have a nice view here from the moon and of the sea here as well. Uh, so where do we need to go? What did you say about it? 
So, okay, okay, wow, it's over here. We need to go to courtyard then. It's uh, probably somewhere at the rear of the castle, like she mentioned, right? The question is, is she able to actually get at me? Yeah, she is, awesome. Run, Serana, run. Because we have a lot of stuff to do. Yeah, it's around this bend. Okay, if you say so. I mean, it is big, but yeah. Ah, look at this, yeah. For sure. I do see hostile creatures, so I'm not sure. Oh, skeletons. Can you do some range stuff, please? Oh, we have a special thing for skeletons. It's called the Dawnbreaker. Where the heck are they actually? Oh, they're on top of there. Hmm. They are tough for some reason. I don't know why, but... Really? Let's uh, heal ourselves. We can do that. And let's go back to the Dawnbreaker with the shield. Right? Where are they? I don't see them. Oh, they're on top of there somewhere. So how do we get on top of there? We need help, Serana. Oh, we can get on top of here. Okay, so uh, apparently this place was guarded. We're pretty strong skeletons, I have to say. The, uh, they're tough bastards. But uh, hey, we managed. Of course, we are able to manage this uh, against just a few skellies. But uh, yeah, we need to go in here then. So there'll probably be some undead here, I guess. Piss off. Ah. ah, what am I afraid of? The old water system. Here we go, buddy. Explosions. Let's see what's in that journal fragment. Oh, okay. Sort of like banished vampires, I guess. <laughs> Okay, whatever. So let's uh, start healing ourselves. Okay, there are more of these uh, bastards. We can have them.
Okay, but first we want to maybe create some potions. Oh, I still have my uh, mage hood on. And I want definitely the Orcus. Um, helmet? Why do I not have it? Oh crap, dude, I maybe... Put that um, in a trunk in um, White Run. That would suck. <laughs> okay, maybe Serana, do you have it by chance? I bet my parents didn't know the half of this part of the castle. All right, let's see what you have. No, she is not. Mm. That sucks. I uh, completely forgot my helmet. Yeah, well, that's what it is. Let's create potions then. see fortify health ah we have some resist stuff and restore health so maybe restore health so there are some skellies here still I hear a lot of creeping things. This is one of those weird double barred security measures that my father put in when he got more paranoid. If we follow that path around, we can find the other switch. Oh. still oh there to possess one. Hey, what are you doing? Okay, um, so there are still uh, hostile creatures here. But where? I think they're here, right? Spiders or something? Yeah, looks like it. I'm poisoned, so I need to drink an antidote if I have one. Um, do I have one? Probably not, but I do have a ring of immunity. So, will that work? Boys and girls, do you think that? Weakness to fire, okay. Nah. That's all, then I'm fine. Um, so, but we want to have the major stamina, of course. Ah, okay, yeah. That's what you meant with double security. Let's quick save. I guess we really deserved it now.
So let's wait for Serana. If we can. If not, we have to be stealthy a little bit. Okay, there's a area transition here. Or not. Do we need to go here? You've made it to the courtyard. Okay. Oh, no. What happened to this place? Everything's been torn down. The whole place looks well, it's like we're the first to set foot in this century. Yep, let's uh Harvest Depot. This used to lead into the castle's great hall. Looks like my father had it sealed up. I used to walk through here after evening meals. It was beautiful once. This was my mother's garden. Do you know yeah. how beautiful something can be when it's tended by a master for hundreds of years? She would have hated to see it like this. Wait. Wait for what? What is this? Yeah, what's up, uh, Serena? So far, this had Dexian said something about that scroll. What was it? Something to do with dragons, I think. Maybe we should try asking at the College of Winterholm. Sounds like before my father became obsessed with a prophecy, my mother and I spent quite a bit of time together. She was very fond of her alchemical garden in the castle courtyard. She taught me quite a bit about cultivating like the best of friends. I would never hesitate to share anything with her. Okay. It was very sudden. It was almost like one day we were a normal family and then the next, I didn't know who they were. I'd try to visit my mother in the garden and she'd quickly shoo me away saying she was much too busy. She had to be up to something in that garden. I'm hoping it's a clue that will tell us where she went. Hmm, okay. There's not a whole lot to tell. You've already seen my father's obsession. My mother's not a whole lot better, but you'll see that soon enough. My father... No, not really. I did spend a lot of time with my mother, but she saw me more like a protege than a daughter. No, what about you? Uh... What were your parents like? Um, what shall we pick? What will be good character choice? Let's uh, say we don't have any parents anymore as Dragonborn. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring up a bad memory. Let's uh, let's just keep going. Yep, let's do that. So let's find our mother then. Something I guess. Is wrong with the moon dial here. Some of the crests are missing, and the dial is askew. I didn't even know the crests could be removed. Maybe my mother's trying to tell us something. Okay, so there are some of these parts here which we need to uh, loot then. So let's uh, let's try to find them. Uh, yeah, so there should be a couple of more maybe here. So what do we need to do? Investigate the moon dial. Okay. So there me, there's something strange with the moon dial. Hey, what about it? What about it, Serana? Let's see. Can we find any other these moon dial things? It's just a table here. Nothing really fancy. Hmm. 
let's see, let's see. What do we miss? What do we miss? Here is one. That's nice. Maybe that's the last one. Nothing here. Now let's place this one. Let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, now it is doing something. Ah, nice. Very clever, mother. Very clever. I've never been in those tunnels before, but I bet they run right under the courtyard. Yeah, sounds like a job for the Dawnbreaker. Well, at least we're getting closer. Let's go. Nice, nice, nice. So let's see what we will find here. Hmm. I've never even seen this part of the castle before. Be careful. I don't know what might be around. That makes two of us. So let's see what we will find here. All the silver stuff. I don't care that much about it anymore. gonna happen yeah yep <laughs> that was what I was thinking that would happen with the dumb breaker awesome that's a cool uh, that's a cool sword <laughs> really it is All right, so I'm loving my Dawnbreaker. Let's see what's in, uh, what we will find more. all day with you no problem skeletons same Yep, that's what's gonna happen. Wait. So, Skellies, come out and play. Almost dead. Oh, there are a lot of these, apparently. Yeah, let's see, we can also use, of course, Unrelenting Force for this. Okay, it's a good time to uh, cost healing. Let's regenerate magic a little bit. And then we can go back to the Dawnbreaker and shield. 
How long do we have left for this part? Plenty of time over 60 minutes. Hello, buddies. Don't worry, I will come to you. So there's another skeleton somewhere? Oh, there. Okay. Alright. Yeah, we really kicked our butts with uh, Serana and me together, right, Serana? Man, these skeletons never stop, do they? Yeah, come on out. I know you're our, uh, an active uh, Kaboom. I think for him I'm going to use the pill blade. Trust you. So that's what we're going to do with um, skeletons we don't trust. We're going to use the Dawnbreaker. Okay, cool. Let's go back to the Dawnbreaker. Let's see, can we maybe do a sneak attack? What the heck is going on with my bow, by the way? Time for the dawn breaker again. Cool. Yeah, they are pretty tough skeletons. Is there a skeleton over there? Yeah, let's just uh, charge him. He's here, I guess? Yeah. Or he was here. Whatever. Cool. Alright. So let's see. Um, man, this is quite a large dungeon. I can't remember this was so large before we actually going to met uh, Valerica. But I think we're getting closer now, so that's good. And meanwhile, let's make sure we don't uh, miss out on uh, very high valuable loot. Let's see, the Dawnbreaker, this, yeah. Let's uh, make sure it has enough um, charges. Because it's really good and effective. Okay, gargoyles. Yep. Let's use the pill blade. Okay, it might be time to do something else. 
Okay, thanks. <laughs> it was a little bit of kill, maybe. I guess so, Serana. You tell me. We're getting close. I'm sure of it. Oh, Vampire Royal Armor. So what does that do, Vampire Royal Armor? Okay. Okay, we need to go there. But how do we get there? Okay, maybe I know something to do. Just uh, use flames. Or is maybe one of this a secret... Ah, yeah. That's what I meant. Okay, Valerica, that was quite a lot of trouble. <coughs> I mean, I think you'll still uh, got in, so... Look at this. Okay, we got in. Ooh, that wasn't easy, but um, we did a good job, I think. Look at this place. This has to be it. I knew she was deep in the necromancy. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Look at all that. She must have spent years collecting these components. I guess so, yeah. about this circle, but it's obviously something. Yep, it is, but let's first, um... Craft some potions, restore magicka. Sure, why not? Something here that tells us where she's gone. My mother was meticulous about her research. If we can find her notes, there might be some hints in there. Sure. I had no idea her laboratory even existed. She had an alchemy set up in her drawing room, but nothing that even comes close to what's here. Looking at the equipment and materials, it looks like she was trying to advance her necromancy. I don't know. Certainly not longevity. Kind of a waste of time for a vampire. Not that I ever saw. My mother had a bit of a thing for magical constructs. Not... not what you're thinking. She just found them fascinating. Hmm, okay. I remember she used to keep a small journal. See if you can dig it up. Yeah, if you don't mind, I'm first going to uh, take all these uh, ingredients so we can create potions. Ah, look at this. 
An alchemy book. Alchemy book. That's awesome. Ah, oh, there are more ingredients here. Nice. That gives us another round at the alchemy lab. Any something here? Yeah, this is also usable stuff. A dragon bone. Wow, look at this. How did she get to that? <laughs> to a dragon bone. And so all of a sudden we can do a lot more. So let's see. Fortify health. Um, yeah, sure. Why not? Cure disease. We can have one of that as well. Resist fire potions. Resist frost potion. Cool. All right. So let's see. Um, yeah, we need to find this diary. Um, apparently, I guess it's uh, somewhere here on top. First, let's steal all our wonderful soul gems. Wow, look at this soul gem fragments. Quite a lot. Let's make sure we quick save. A grand soul gem just lay laying around like that. And ingredients. Always love ingredients, of course. So, um, yeah, while we're plundering everything here, let's also keep an eye out for our diary. So, where could it be, guys? Then I guess it's somewhere uh, on top of here. Let's um, deactivate my timer. It's five minutes left, but else I know I will be like. My uh, iPhone timer is so freaking loud, so that's why I am. Um, want to try to prevent that from happening here live, that I get scared uh, shitless. So, ingredients, 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 but no diary, I guess. I don't know, really. It's strange. I guess it might be here somewhere. Oh. That wasn't a really good idea, was it? Let's take these books. Maybe they're worth something. So let's see. Is her diary here somewhere? What do you guys think? Take these books. Okay, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. What does the quest lock say? It's not on the map, okay. That means we need to manually find it somewhere. Let's see, what can we do for help? We can definitely cast Mage Light. Is there anything we missed here? Except for ingredients. Nah, I don't think it's here. I think it's somewhere at the top, her journal. Maybe here somewhere. Ah, look at this. This is an expensive book, but not her journal. Rolls of paper. Where could it be? Where could it be? It must have been here somewhere. I mean, nah, Just creep clusters. You find anything yet? Keep searching for her notes. She probably had a journal or something. If not, it's probably then over there. 
Or it's, it's a hidden uh, compartment somewhere. That's also a possibility, of course. Can we not activate this? Well, it must be here somewhere. I mean, hey, look at this random magical amulet. Is it not here, or what is this? No, it's the balcony. Um, yeah, good question, uh, Serana. Ah, look what we find here. I guess we blasted uh, every book out of the bookshelf with uh, Dragon's uh, Breath. The fruits were down. Any luck here? Yep. You did? Let me see them. I only know what she told me. She had a theory about soul gems. That the souls inside of them don't just vanish when they're used. They end up in the soul cairn. The soul cairn is home to very powerful beings. Necromancers send them souls and receive powers of their own in return. My mother spent a lot of time trying to contact them directly, to travel to the soul cairn itself. That circle in the center of the room is definitely some type of portal. If I'm reading this right, there's a formula here that should give us safe passage the into the soul cairn. A handful of soul gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. Uh -oh. <sighs> Damn it. We're also going to need a sample of her blood, which, if we could get that, we wouldn't even be trying to do this in the first place. Hmm, not bad. We'd better hope that's good enough. Mistakes with these kind of portals can be gruesome. Anyway, enough of that. Let's get started. Yeah, let's get started. Oh, good. Well then, let's head over to the portal vessel and I'll do the rest. Alrighty. Then the rest is up. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. We're about to find out, huh? It's uh, simple as that. Yeah, go ahead. What are we going to do? I mean. Then the rest is up to me. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what this thing is going to do when I add my blood. Go, go, go. Of course. What is it? I've been asking myself the same thing since we came back to the castle. She was so sure of what we did to my father. I couldn't help but go along with her. I never thought of the cost. Possibly. I guess even a vampire mother is still a mother. She worried about me. About all of us. But she wanted to get me as far away from my father as possible before he really went over the edge. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I just didn't expect anyone to care how I felt about her. Thank you. Are we ready then? Yes. Alright. Here goes. Go, go, go. It's a good thing I didn't waste the ingredients on the um, alchemy lab. Yeah, we can enter the portal, but I am going to try something first, and that is by fast traveling to Whiterun to get my uh, Orcish helmet back. <laughs> but we're not going to do that in this part anymore, guys. Um, we passed the 40 minutes mark already. So, hope you guys uh, liked the part. And uh, we're going to enter this Soul Cairn in the next part, where probably Valerica is her mother. So, yeah, let's find it out. So, thanks for watching again, and hope to see you at one of the next parts. Take care, guys. Bye bye.